Listening to what's out in the water. A lot of great friends, a lot of friends at all. Countries often deal with the challenge of illegal goods entering their borders, making it a crime to sell these items within city limits. How do these items make their way into a country despite strict rules? The answer lies in smuggling, where people come up with clever ways to transport forbidden items. Smugglers, known for their craftiness, use smart tactics to outsmart the police. Despite the risk of getting caught, they often escape, although law enforcement's persistent efforts sometimes disrupt their activities. Let's delve into the top 15 smartest smugglers in history, exploring their intelligence and cunning in the intricate world of illegal trade. Number 15. The Art of Counterfeit Money Printing Counterfeiting money poses significant threats, undermining economic systems and exposing those involved to considerable risks. A noteworthy case in Colombia in 2005 exemplifies the dangers associated with counterfeit currency smuggling. Operation Sunset orchestrated by counterfeit experts, unfolded in an inconspicuous Bogota printing house, producing around $41 million worth of meticulously crafted counterfeit U.S. banknotes. The counterfeiters went to great lengths, using similar paper, watermarks, color-shifting ink, and security threads to mimic genuine currency. The quality was so high that the fake banknotes could easily pass casual inspections, even fooling some banknote checking machines. The smuggling strategy involved incorporating the counterfeit money into the U.S. economy through a well-established courier network. They employed inventive methods to hide the fake cash, ranging from magazine covers to wall paintings and even the soles of shoes. However, the massive scale of the operation led to its downfall. Acting on a tip, U.S. and Colombian authorities launched a joint investigation, resulting in the seizure of $6.1 million in fake notes in Bogota, and an additional $1.2 million in Florida. This marked the largest confiscation of counterfeit currency intended for smuggling into the U.S., highlighting the crucial role of vigilant law enforcement in preserving economic integrity. The subsequent arrest of 38 individuals, including the masterminds, and the dismantling of the printing press in Bogota marked a significant victory for law enforcement. Despite determined efforts to infiltrate the American financial market with counterfeit money, the operation was successfully thwarted, emphasizing the persistent threat posed by smuggling to global economies. This incident underscored the importance of international collaboration in combating illicit activities and emphasized the need for ongoing innovation in banknote design to outpace counterfeiters. In response, several countries, including the U.S., introduced new banknotes with enhanced security features, making replication more challenging and highlighting the ongoing race between law enforcement and illicit actors. In the broader context of smuggling, counterfeiting money serves as a reminder of the potential macroeconomic implications. While many smuggling stories focus on tangible goods, this case highlights the invisible impact of smuggling on economic systems, disrupting financial stability and eroding trust. Number 14. The Great Narcotic Submarine Adventure In the realm of inventive smuggling techniques, the use of a submarine for transporting narcotics stands out as a remarkable feat, earning it the moniker The Great Narcotic Submarine Adventure. This audacious operation unfolded in Colombia, a notorious hub for drug production and trafficking. In July 2019, U.S. Coast Guard authorities intercepted a custom-built semi-submersible narco-submarine in the eastern Pacific Ocean, loaded with over 17,000 pounds of cocaine valued at an estimated 232 million. The submarine was an engineering marvel, capable of traveling long distances while remaining 90% submerged, making it nearly undetectable to radar. Typically constructed in Colombian jungles, these narco-submarines use fiberglass over a wooden frame to reduce their magnetic signature, evading sonar and radar detection. Equipped with a small periscope and open-air intake pipes, they barely break the water surface while in motion. The refined construction process takes about three months, costing up to $1 million, an investment quickly recovered given the potential value of the cargo. Crewed by three to five individuals, submariners undergo rigorous selection and training due to the life-threatening nature of their mission. 
Operating without basic amenities and adequate safety measures, these vessels underscore the tremendous risks smugglers take for their illicit operations. Despite the daring capture of this specific submarine during a high-speed pursuit by U.S. authorities, it highlighted the increasing complexity of international drug smuggling. Law enforcement has intercepted numerous narco submarines, but the actual number navigating the high seas remains unknown. The ongoing cat and mouse game between law enforcement and smugglers is a testament to human ingenuity driven by the allure of substantial profits in the shadowy realm of illicit narcotics. Number 13. Gold Inside Soap While we wouldn't crown these individuals as the epitome of genius smugglers, their endeavors showcased a rather adept skill in concealing gold, a commodity that should have been declared, or better yet, left untouched by the long arm of smuggling. Picture this at Mangalore International Airport. Customs officials unearthed gold granules valued at approximately 325, cunningly hidden within a bottle of chocolate syrup and discreetly stashed among four unsuspecting soap bars. The perpetrator had arrived early in the morning on an Air India Express flight from Dubai, only to find himself apprehended after the discovery. Now shift your gaze to another incident, this time at Tiruttarapalli International Airport in Tamil Nadu. Here, customs officers intercepted a staggering discovery. Over $50,000 worth of gold ingeniously tucked away inside seemingly ordinary soap bars. The smugglers, displaying a commendable level of ingenuity, meticulously hollowed out the soap, creating carefully crafted gold pouches wrapped in black plastic to fill the voids. These modified bars were then seamlessly returned to their original packaging, leaving no traces of their illicit contents. Despite their efforts, the authorities proved more astute, ensuring that the second individual involved met the same fate, an arrest for his ambitious smuggling endeavors. Number 12. The Great Garlic Scheme In the realm of smuggling, thoughts often gravitate towards illicit activities involving drugs, arms, or stolen artifacts. However, one of the most intriguing instances of smuggling centered around an unexpectedly innocuous commodity garlic. This captivating saga, known as the Great Garlic Scheme, unfolded during the years 2003 to 2007 and was masterminded by an Irish entrepreneur named Paul Begley. Begley's audacious plan targeted the European Union, EU, and hinged on the clandestine importation of Chinese garlic. Exploiting a tax loophole within the EU, which imposed a substantial 9.6% duty on Chinese garlic imports to safeguard local producers, Begley shrewdly manipulated the system. He falsely declared over a thousand tons of Chinese garlic as apples, a move that attracted a significantly lower import tax of just 1.2% compared to garlic from other countries. The brilliance of Begley's scheme lay in navigating the intricacies of the EU's complex customs code system and capitalizing on the limited technology available for verifying the country of origin for garlic. Begley's operation proved remarkably successful, allowing him to evade approximately 1.4 million euros in taxes, while the cumulative import duty lost by the EU was estimated at around 1.6 million euros. However, the grand facade of the Great Garlic Scheme eventually crumbled when vigilant customs officials grew suspicious of the unusually high volume of Apple imports. A thorough investigation followed, unraveling the audaciously simple yet effective scheme. In the end, Begley faced the consequences, receiving a six-year prison sentence, later reduced to two years on appeal. The garlic, once a seemingly innocent culinary ingredient, had become a key player in a high-stakes smuggling escapade that captivated the world. Number 11. Truckload of Ammo In the southernmost city of Texas, Brownsville, the issue of stolen cars intertwining with smuggling contraband has prompted the establishment of a dedicated special investigations unit. This unit, specializing in both auto theft and narcotics, diligently probes reports of vehicles suspected to be involved in smuggling activities. In a noteworthy case, officers from our Special Investigations Unit cast their scrutiny on a suspicious pickup truck nestled in a lot earmarked for export to Mexico. At first glance, the truck appears to be an ordinary vehicle, but an unexpected revelation awaits the investigators. The keen senses of our canine unit draw attention to the truck bed area, revealing subtle anomalies. 
A welded shut tailgate and an altered bed liner with an uneven base, held in place by loose and conspicuously new-looking bolts, raise suspicion. Upon removing the bed liner, a startling discovery unfolds. Thousands of loose ammunition rounds, accompanied by magazines and a few concealed firearms. The truck bed, seemingly unassuming, conceals a depth of about three inches filled with an extensive array of loose ammunition. Now faced with the daunting task of meticulous counting and sorting, officers unravel the magnitude of the haul. While the seized ammunition, magazines, and firearms constitute a substantial find, law enforcement emphasizes that this cache merely represents a fraction of the illicit goods individuals attempt to smuggle into and out of the United States. The diligent efforts of the Special Investigations Unit underscore the ongoing challenges posed by those seeking to exploit stolen vehicles for nefarious activities in the realm of contraband smuggling. Number 10. The Pigeon Plot – Colombian Drug Traffickers Using Carrier Pigeons The age-old saying, old ways won't open new doors, encounters a fascinating exception in the ingenious methods employed by drug traffickers in Colombia. In a captivating instance from 2011, Colombian police stumbled upon a remarkably creative smuggling operation that resurrected an ancient method of communication, carrier pigeons. The individual responsible for this could be one of the smartest smugglers in all history. This innovative endeavor saw traffickers raising their own pigeons, acclimating them to fly between two specific locations. The clandestine cargo, small packages of cocaine and marijuana securely strapped to the birds' bodies. While the method displayed a certain level of ingenuity, it wasn't entirely foolproof. A pigeon, burdened by an excessively heavy payload of around 45 grams of drugs, was intercepted when it failed to reach its destination, landing near a police station in the city of Bukaramanga. Despite this setback, the use of pigeons provided distinct advantages. These birds could navigate directly to their destination, bypassing the myriad obstacles that ground vehicles might encounter. Furthermore, they left virtually no trace of their journey, complicating efforts to trace the origins or destination of the contraband. The pigeon plot serves as a vivid illustration of the enduring cat-and-mouse game between traffickers and law enforcement. Traffickers perpetually seek novel and harder-to-detect methods of smuggling, and the audacity showcased in this case combined with the exploitation of a natural and ancient method of communication, marks it as one of the most creative smuggling attempts in recent history. However, it also underscores the darker side of human ingenuity, revealing how talent and innovation can be twisted towards nefarious ends. This case serves as a stark reminder for authorities worldwide to maintain vigilance and innovation in their approaches, ensuring they stay ahead of the ever-evolving strategies employed by smugglers in this ongoing game of wits. Number 9. Forbidden Fruit – Cocaine in Fresh Fruits Even the most ordinary items can become unsuspecting accomplices in audacious smuggling attempts. Fresh fruits, with their innocuous and commonplace nature, have become the front for one of the most innovative drug smuggling operations in recent history. In 2014, Spanish police officers in Madrid made a significant bust, unraveling a massive drug operation that ingeniously concealed cocaine within seemingly ordinary perishable goods, hollowed-out pineapples imported from Costa Rica. The architect of this plan could be one of the smartest smugglers in all history. This operation stood out for its use of a perishable commodity, something often overlooked as a potential vessel for illicit contraband. The hollowed-out pineapples were found to house tightly packed cylinders of cocaine. To achieve nearly flawless concealment, each manipulated fruit was refilled with compact cocaine cylinders, resealed, and then coated with a yellowish wax mimicking the pineapple's natural color and texture. This meticulous technique rendered the illicit cargo nearly undetectable, presenting the appearance of regular, unaltered fruit. The ingenuity of the smugglers extended to the use of the rip-on, rip-off system. The shipment contained a mix of clean and tainted cargo, with some pineapples filled with drugs and others left untouched. This strategy aimed to allow a portion of the shipment to be seized, while ensuring the rest went undetected. However, through diligent inspections and the assistance of trained dogs, 
The police managed to uncover 200 kilograms of cocaine cunningly hidden within these deceptive fruits. Despite the traffickers' ingenuity, authorities successfully thwarted the operation, underscoring the importance of continuous vigilance, sophisticated detection methods, and thorough inspection protocols. In a similar incident in 2018, Spanish and Portuguese authorities confiscated over 745 kilograms of cocaine concealed inside fresh pineapples arriving from South America. Following a pattern similar to the previous operation, the drugs were neatly packed into hollowed-out fruit and covered with pineapple pulp. This successful bust resulted from an extended international investigation, highlighting the level of coordination required to counter such creative smuggling attempts. These cases underscore the significance of international cooperation in combating the global war on drugs. The collaboration between Spanish, Portuguese, and South American authorities in these instances exemplifies how shared information and resources can lead to substantial drug busts, emphasizing the ongoing need for joint efforts to tackle evolving and creative smuggling techniques. Number 8. Drugs in Implants The astounding lengths to which smugglers will go for a payday are continually revealed, with some resorting to surgical procedures to conceal drugs within their bodies. Airport security personnel, especially vigilant with passengers arriving from notorious drug trafficking destinations like Pagoda, Colombia, remain on high alert due to the prevalence of such activities. In one striking case, a woman took the concept of concealment to new extremes by smuggling drugs inside her breast implants. After undergoing an airport security check in Spain, the woman's evasive responses raised suspicion, prompting authorities to delve deeper into the situation. While initial assumptions focused on potential concealment in her luggage or on her person, the reality proved even more audacious. Upon a thorough pat-down by a female officer, peculiarities arose when blood-stained bandages were discovered beneath the woman's clothing. These bandages concealed recent incisions, a detail she attributed to undergoing new implants. However, skepticism lingered, leading the authorities to transport her to a hospital for further examination. At the medical facility, a surgical team uncovered the shocking truth bags concealed within each breast implant, holding a total of three pounds of drugs. The street value of this illicit cargo amounted to approximately $35,000 per pound. The elaborate ruse involving surgical alterations and a seemingly innocuous medical explanation underscored the relentless determination of smugglers to navigate stringent security measures. This incident serves as a stark reminder of the ongoing challenges faced by airport security in detecting and preventing increasingly inventive methods employed by those seeking to traffic drugs across borders. Number 7. Secret Compartments in Shoes Smuggling attempts can sometimes gain such notoriety that they trigger global security changes, as exemplified by the infamous case of Richard Reed, colloquially known as the Shoe Bomber. In December 2001, during an American Airlines flight from Paris to Miami, Reed, a British citizen and member of Al-Qaeda, attempted to detonate explosives concealed in his shoes. Reed had hollowed out his shoes and packed them with plastic explosives. Mid-flight, he tried to ignite the explosives using a match, generating smoke and a peculiar smell that caught the attention of vigilant flight attendants and passengers. Quick thinking and courageous actions from both the crew and passengers thwarted Reed's plans, leading to his capture before he could carry out the detonation. The aftermath of this failed smuggling attempt prompted immediate and far-reaching repercussions. Almost overnight, checking shoes became a standard procedure at airport security checkpoints worldwide, a practice that remains in effect today. Despite the plot's failure, it shed light on a terrifying new smuggling method compelling aviation security agencies globally to rethink and fortify their security procedures. The case of the shoe bomber serves as a stark reminder that smuggling attempts are not confined to the pursuit of profiting from illicit goods. They can also be associated with sinister terror plots that pose a significant threat to global security. This incident underscores the ever-present need for heightened vigilance and adaptation in security measures to counter evolving and unpredictable threats. Number 6. Tobacco-Filled Fake Carrots 
In the perpetual cat-and-mouse game between smugglers and customs officials, the cleverness of smuggling methods often reaches astounding levels. A striking illustration of this occurred in 2013 when Moldovan authorities intercepted a truck at the Romanian border, engaged in smuggling tobacco hidden in a rather unconventional manner, within fabricated carrots. Whoever thought of this could be one of the smartest smugglers in all history. The smugglers had painstakingly hollowed out thousands of carrots, filling them with cut tobacco and then expertly resealing them. These imitation carrots, interspersed among genuine ones in the truck, were designed to masquerade as standard cargo during a superficial inspection. At first glance, the truck appeared to be transporting a straightforward load of carrots, a common sight at customs borders globally. The driver presented valid documents, giving no apparent cause for suspicion. Yet astute customs officials observed something amiss about the shipment, the inconsistent weight and peculiar appearance of the carrots. Upon closer scrutiny, the audacious nature of the smuggling attempt became apparent. Numerous carrots were meticulously crafted replicas made from orange-hued paraffin wax. The hollow interiors concealed tightly packed high-quality cut tobacco. In aggregate, the smugglers sought to transport hundreds of kilograms of tobacco ingeniously concealed within these artificial carrots. Global tobacco smuggling remains a significant challenge, primarily due to substantial taxation on tobacco products rendering illegal trade highly profitable. The counterfeit carrot method showcased the smugglers' ingenuity, exploiting the commonplace to camouflage their illicit cargo in plain view. This instance serves as a quintessential example of the lengths to which smugglers are willing to go to transport illegal goods across borders. It also underscores the pivotal role of customs officers, whose vigilance and meticulous attention to detail often constitute the first and last line of defense against such inventive smuggling attempts. However, even though this particular endeavor was thwarted, it raises a crucial question regarding the multitude of innovative smuggling methods that might be eluding detection. This realization underscores the necessity for continual training of customs officials and the incorporation of advanced technologies such as artificial intelligence and machine learning to enhance the identification of illicit activities. In the expansive narrative of smuggling ventures, the case of tobacco-filled fake carrots stands out for its audacity and simplicity, a poignant reminder that smuggling is not solely about exotic or high-value items. Frequently, it involves the transformation of the everyday and the ordinary through human ingenuity into vessels for illegal trade. It reinforces the notion that the realm of smuggling is not just one of criminality, but also a domain of creativity, resourcefulness, and resilience, albeit tragically applied for nefarious ends. Before we move on, here's today's subscriber's pick. Take a look at this image. A concealed car. One can't help but marvel at the ingenuity employed. Whoever is behind this could be one of the smartest smugglers in all history. While the conventional spots under the seat or in the glove box may be the initial considerations for stashing items, the pickup in question takes concealment to a whole new level. The element of surprise certainly adds to the intrigue. The back of the pickup reveals a hidden compartment that can hold a substantial amount of whatever is inside that mysterious package. The origin of this creative automotive concealment is indicated by the Panama license plate. As for the contents, it remains elusive. It could be currency, valuable items, or even illicit substances. Deciphering the nature of the concealed cargo requires a vigilant and sharp-eyed law enforcement team. Now viewers, what are your thoughts on this? Do you find it to be clever? Number 5. The Unholy Smuggle – Heroin Hidden Inside a Crucifix Within the complex world of smuggling, items of religious significance have not evaded their role as vessels for illicit trade. A notable case involves heroin concealed within a hollowed-out crucifix, a bold and audacious move that juxtaposes the sacred symbol with the profanity of the illegal drug trade. This audacious smuggling scheme came to light in 2016 when officers from the U.S. Customs and Border Protection at Baltimore Washington International Airport intercepted a package originating from Kenya and addressed it to a location in New Jersey. Seemingly innocuous at first glance, the package contained a two-pound brass crucifix, a choice of concealment designed to fly under the radar. 
However, the sharp instincts of the officers and their dedication to thorough inspection protocols prompted further scrutiny, revealing that the crucifix possessed an unusual weight for its size. A meticulous X-ray scan of the crucifix disclosed a peculiar anomaly, an irregularity in the image suggesting that the item was not entirely solid. Fueled by their suspicions, the customs officers proceeded to drill into the crucifix, uncovering a hidden compartment containing a white powder. Subsequent tests confirmed the substance to be heroin, carrying a street value of nearly $50,000. This bust vividly illustrates the extent to which smugglers exploit religious symbols to conceal illicit goods. The case, which gained notoriety for its audacious use of a crucifix to bypass international security measures, shocked observers with its blasphemous nature. The interception highlighted the effectiveness of stringent security protocols and the skills of customs officers in identifying such inventive ploys. Despite the attempt to blend the illicit with the sacred, law enforcement successfully discerned the smuggling plot, preventing the contraband from reaching its intended destination. Number 4. The Case of the Smuggled Diamonds In mobile phones, diamond smuggling fueled by the allure of these precious stones has a lengthy and tainted history. Smugglers consistently employ innovative methods to outsmart authorities, as evidenced by a 2019 case in India. In March of that year, customs officials at Indira Gandhi International Airport in Delhi detained two men arriving from Hong Kong who had declared nothing suspicious. However, due to their suspicious behavior, officials decided to inspect their baggage. To the officers' surprise, they uncovered a number of high-end mobile phones in the passengers' luggage. What initially appeared to be a routine duty evasion case took an unexpected turn when officials noticed an abnormal weight to the phones. Upon disassembling the mobile phones, they revealed the true smuggled items, diamond crystals expertly concealed within the phone's back panels. The diamonds, totaling around 500 carats, were of high quality and had been shrewdly hidden to circumvent customs. This audacious smuggling attempt stands as a testament to the ingenuity of smugglers and underscores the vital role played by vigilant customs officials in safeguarding a country's economic interests and enforcing international trade laws. Number 3. Drug-Stuffed Roasted Chickens In a surprising case from 2013 at Kotoka International Airport in Ghana, amidst the growing audacity and creativity of smuggling attempts, a Ghanaian woman returning from Sao Paulo, Brazil, became the center of attention. While her luggage appeared ordinary, containing what seemed to be a typical meal enjoyed by many roasted chickens, her uneasy demeanor and the fact that she had traveled from a known drug trafficking route raised suspicion among customs officials. Deciding to scrutinize her luggage more closely, customs officials were startled by the unexpected discovery. The two roasted chickens she carried weren't filled with the usual stuffing of herbs or bread. Instead, the insides of these poultry dishes concealed a much more sinister filling cocaine. The woman had ingeniously used the roasted chickens as a cover to conceal approximately three kilograms of cocaine. Each chicken had been expertly cooked, stuffed with the drug, and then repacked to resemble a regular appetizing meal. This unconventional smuggling method aimed to bypass airport customs by capitalizing on the ordinary and mundane to camouflage the illicit substance. Despite the woman's creative subterfuge, the vigilance of Ghanaian customs officials prevailed. Their alertness, knowledge of trafficking routes, and attention to traveler behavior enabled them to spot the irregularity and thwart the smuggling attempt. The woman was subsequently arrested and the drug-stuffed chickens were confiscated, preventing a substantial quantity of cocaine from reaching the streets. This incident illustrates the dynamic nature of smuggling methods, requiring customs officials to adapt to inventive tactics. It emphasizes the importance of human intuition alongside technology in detecting illicit goods. The case involving drug-stuffed roasted chickens highlights the creativity of smugglers and the ongoing challenges faced by customs officials globally. This underscores the need for constant vigilance, adaptability, and training. As long as there is a demand for illegal substances, smuggling attempts will persist, necessitating a comprehensive approach involving enforcement, advanced detection technology, and initiatives to reduce the demand for illicit substances. Number 2. 
concealed ivory in timber. The illicit trafficking of ivory, fueled by a high demand for decorative and medicinal items, has prompted smugglers to employ ingenious tactics to evade law enforcement. A notable case unfolded in 2015 when Singaporean authorities intercepted a seemingly innocuous shipment of timber from Africa. Initially registered as carrying timber logs, an X-ray examination brought to light a concealed and ominous secret within the cargo. Several logs displayed irregularities, sparking suspicion among officials. Upon manually inspecting the suspicious logs, authorities made a startling discovery. Expertly hidden inside the hollowed-out logs were ivory tusks. A staggering 3.7 tons of ivory, equating to almost 1,800 tusks, were unearthed. This significant haul marked the incident as one of the most extensive ivory seizures in history, signifying the tragic outcome of numerous slaughtered elephants. The sophistication of this elaborate deception underscored the lengths to which smugglers would go to capitalize on the illicit ivory trade. Furthermore, it emphasized the crucial role of vigilance and technology in combating wildlife smuggling. Despite the smugglers' cunning tactics, it was the sharp awareness of officials and the effective application of X-ray scanning technology that ultimately exposed the grim cargo hidden within the ostensibly innocent timber shipment. Number 1. The Ingenious Fuel Tank Hideaway in the relentless pursuit of evading law enforcement, drug smugglers often resort to ingenious methods that push the boundaries of imagination and audacity. A compelling illustration of this occurred at the U.S.-Mexico border in 2011. During a routine inspection near the Texas border, U.S. Border Patrol agents halted a pickup truck. Initially appearing unremarkable, the agents became suspicious when they observed that the truck's fuel tank seemed unusually large for its model. Upon closer scrutiny, the agents decided to delve deeper into their suspicions, leading to the discovery of a meticulously crafted false compartment within the fuel tank. Concealed within this covert space were 80 bundles of marijuana, totaling approximately 75 kilograms. The drugs were meticulously wrapped in plastic and tape, presumably to shield them from the corrosive effects of gasoline. This case vividly underscores the extraordinary lengths to which smugglers will go to transport their illicit goods, transforming everyday objects into intricate hiding places. The truck's fuel tank, an unexpected choice for surreptitious concealment, proved to be an effective hiding spot. However, the vigilance and experience of the border agents ensured that this inventive attempt was thwarted underscoring the paramount importance of keen observation and expertise in the ongoing battle against smuggling. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.